Why are you talking about this? I mean, why are you bringing up something that happened so long ago? What difference does it make? It makes a hell of a big difference to me. I've always had this picture of you and dad meeting in college. The struggling young designer, the wealthy freshman campus queen. You could have had any man you wanted, I bet, mother. But you saw something in dad, and the two of you fell in love. And that's exactly how it happened. Is it? Now you're telling me there was someone else, that he was in love with another girl before he met you. There is nothing unusual in people having more than one romance in college. You certainly did. We're not talking about me. We're talking about you, you and dad. He married you right after your freshman year. Why the rush? We were in love. I mean, there was no reason to wait. What about Liz Henderson? You said he never got over her, that he's still in love with her. What happened back then to make him leave her and marry you? If he was in love with her, then I can only think of one thing. Were you pregnant? If he was in love with her before he married you, was he in love with her when he married you? Is that the way it really happened? In life, there are no simple answers. There is to this, a simple yes or no. Did you and dad have to get married? Just tell me the truth. You were conceived in love. Is that what you want to know? Then you were pregnant. Yes! What difference does that make? I mean, it made no difference to your father. It didn't make a difference to me. You were going to be born anyway. It's just a question of timing. Oh, yes, timing. It has a lot to do with all of our lives, isn't it? No, Mother, you're wrong. It made a lot of difference. You gave Dad no choice. Knowing the kind of man he was, as soon as he found out you were pregnant, of course he married you. He would have anyway. Would he? What about Liz Henderson? Aren't you afraid he might have wanted to marry her? Oldest trick in the book, Mother. <clears throat> I know how you can be when you want something. And you wanted Dad. You wanted him, and when you didn't think you could have him, you got yourself pregnant. Nobody gets themselves pregnant. Maybe not. You're a beautiful woman. From what Dad said, you were probably the most beautiful freshman on campus. I'm sure he was very flattered as hell to have the beautiful Stephanie Douglas after him. That isn't how it happened at all. No, then tell me. That's all I'm asking. Just tell me how it happened. I can't believe that you're saying this. I can't believe you actually think that I cold-heartedly trapped your father into marriage. I didn't say he was cold-hearted. So you want to know if I trapped Daddy by sex? I didn't. <laughs> 